Oh, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, today we're actually gonna be whipping out the dirt bikes. As you guys know, I got the sexiest bike on the street. Wrong. <laughs> All right, leave in the comments the gray KTM or Julius's KTM. Drop it down in the comments. What you guys like more? Mine has less scratches. Less scratch. Yours does has a lot less scratches. Uh oh. Does he really think he's gonna get the middle parking spot? Hey, that's my parking spot. But we're actually gonna be headed to the new property today. We're gonna go hit some hill climbs and just do a lot of fun stuff. Should be a good time. Christian, what you riding there, bud? That thing. It's like a nice hunk of shit. <laughs> <laughs> now this is actually a 2022's KTM 150 XCW. I bought this thing in 2022 for $6,000. Absolute steal. But now it's the guest bike, so uh, Christian's gonna rip it. Do you think it'll start? Barely runs, but it starts. <laughs> Let's get these things on the trailer and uh, run to the new property. Guys, we have made it. Now, I'm not gonna bore you guys too much. You guys know the property, you guys have been here. We're gonna go ahead, get the bikes off the trailer, slap on the helmets, and go rip. Let's go ahead, go have some fun. Today's video is sponsored by Factor. Now, what is Factor? Factor is a subscription-based company that sends amazing meals to your doorstep that are super easy to make. Now, let's go ahead and bust open this box. Let's check this joker out. So, in the box, it does come with some ice packs, and these things stay cold for a long time, so no worry about food spoiling. Let's go ahead and get them all out. This box should contain six meals, I believe, and, which I'm super excited about, a bunch of smoothies. Fresh, never-frozen meals, chef-prepared, dietitian approved no no prep, no mess. Eat and eat in two minutes. I mean, just how much better could it get? It's honestly faster than fast food. I want to tear into these smoothies and see what's in here. So this is mango, strawberry banana, dude. Tropical fruit or strawberry banana? Which one, Christian? What strawberry, do you think? Strawberry banana. That's what I was thinking. 100% plant-based. That's pretty cool. 120 calories. Mmm, healthy. Dang, that's pretty good. So we got spicy jalapeno beef bowl, sun-dried tomato chicken, herb crush chicken. Let's try the spicy beef bowl. I mean, that looks phenomenal. So, throw it in there. One, two, three, four, no, five, whoa, whoa. two minutes. <laughs> Made simple. So while we got our milk cooking, I wanna go ahead and tell you guys, you can get 50% off on your first box if you use code GRADEN50 at factor75.com. I have the links down in the description and in the comments so you can guys go down there and click on them. I'm really excited to try this. I think it's gonna be gas. Let's go ahead and pop this bad boy out of the microwave. I'm actually super excited to try this because Factor is actually owned by HelloFresh. And it's gonna be awesome being able to switch between both brands because HelloFresh was so good and now we get to try Factor. And the cool thing is, is now I have a discount code for not only Factor, but also HelloFresh that you guys can use. Oh my gosh, remember when we had HelloFresh? Yes. That was so good. <laughs> I, just, I, can't, I don't even know how good this is gonna be. Let's go ahead and get a bite. Ooh. Is that it? I literally just put it in the microwave. You gotta get a bite. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Whoa. Yeah? That's microwave, great. dude. The microwave, bro. That's fantastic. Two oh minutes. Dude. <laughs> that is good. Between Factor and HelloFresh, no more fast food. There is no point. This is as fast as it gets, and it is better than anything you can get from town. I promise you that. I'm telling you guys, if you've never tried a company like Factor or HelloFresh, give it a go. Go ahead. You got 50% off on Factor right now on your first box. It is unbelievable how good of food you can get shipped straight to your door and then have meals for the entire week lined up ready to roll. There's no point to go grocery shopping. I promise you that. Like I said, head to Factor75.com, use code Rate in 50, get 50% 50 off your first box. Go ahead, let's kick it back into today's video. Hope y'all enjoy. Oh, today's gonna be a good day. It's gonna be weird. We haven't really rode with the corn up yet. So it looks like one of the guys that was hunting this place is actually here picking up all his stands today. Hopefully we don't have a head-on collision in the trails. Oh. 
There he is. Well, just talking to them for a little bit about some deer hunting. Deer hunting's gonna be fun out here this year. I'm not sure how much I'm gonna deer hunt this place, but uh, it's definitely gonna be fun whenever we do decide to come out here and deer hunt. But really, it's gonna be a lot of fun seeing what deer we have out here on camera. Because last year when I bought this property, I didn't get to get my cameras out like quick enough. The antlers done started dropping. But I guess what we're gonna do today is kind of ride around, hopefully hit some hill climbs, send these bikes up some mountains, baby. Oh gosh, this side hill's so wet. It's been raining for like a week straight, so everything's soaking wet. But man, we have not rode dirt bikes in a hot minute. We just do not ride dirt bikes as much as we should. So every time we get on these things, we're pretty bad. Like we gotta ride all day before we actually get any confidence on the bike. All right, let's hop across here. I cleared some brush. Maybe we can hit some hill climbs right over here. Should be on cross right here, yep. I gotta get back in here and clean this out better. Yep, that's a steep climb right there. Ooh, them rocks at the bottom will be gnarly. Let's see here. What can we get into today? Let's hit this climb right here. See if everybody follows. <laughs> Alright, Christian's gonna be a fun one. Christian broke his leg like not too long ago and hasn't been on a bike since. There's no way. You got it. It's not happening. Bro, you got it. First, second gear. Get some speed going. Wah, just don't let up. Alright, well, I'll try it, but I'm gonna probably throw the bike. Throw it. I don't care. Just don't hit me. I'm gonna hide behind this tree. Uh-oh. Here he comes. Yep. You let off the gas. Nah, this bike doesn't have ass like that does. Oh, shit. Oh, that's scary. I don't know if I want to do that. Dude, that is steep. Holy Christian, you got to make it, dude. Let me get a better run up. I just don't think it's happening. You got to get in a lower gear. I'm in first gear. No. That ain't first. First is all the way down, bud. I know where first is. Dude, there's no way. That sounds like second all day. That is a hard bike to hill climb, though. Hear me out. I'm gonna try one more time. And when I don't make it in first gear, one of y'all motherfuckers gotta try it on the spike. <laughs> <laughs> you got it. You're right there. I made it. First is a lot peppier, ain't it? That digs out quick there, bud. I really thought I didn't need a whole lot of run up. Dude, why is it so steep right here? Like, I can't get it to turn. Shit! That sounded like it hurt. Yeah, a little bit. Dude, I can't believe I was hitting that shit in second gear that whole time. Dude, yeah, that bogged out hard. All right, we gotta find another hill. We're hill climbing today, boys. Oh, a little log crossing. This is beautiful. Oh yeah, picture perfect. Oh, I know what we can do. Have y'all seen the abandoned house? No. There's an abandoned house. Really? We might have to go check it out. On your property? No, not mine, but the property over. You remember that old house site we passed that one day? Dude, that might be pretty dope. It's a nice ride over there too. It's a beautiful ride. We just gotta figure out how to get there. <laughs> so the adventure starts. We're gonna find this abandoned house and we're gonna find some hill climbs. What? I wanna go fast. What? I wanna go fast. Fast. Dude <laughs> wants to go fast, so we're gonna go to the fast trail. I'm not as good as going fast anymore. I don't know why. I kind of lost all my skill. I like to tell everyone I go controllably out of control. But on a dirt bike, I'm just out of control. Especially when I'm not used to it. Like right now. Woo! Your tire's sliding everywhere. The house is definitely the other direction. I already made a wrong turn somewhere. Ah, there's a f***ing... Oh, hold on! What? There's a bug in my ear. Dude, it only happens to you. They like your freaking ears. Probably because the helmet's never been washed. That, that too. There's probably bugs that just live in your helmet. They're probably in this thing when I put it on. All right. Where'd Julius go? I'm assuming he went this way because he didn't wait at that turn for us. See, now you really can't go fast. Julius would come around a blind turn hauling ass, dude. That's a dirt bike track, so he definitely went this way. Pretty sure I know where this house is. Buddy done disappeared on us. Julius! Wait. I don't really know where I'm going. Why is he over that way? Buddy's free balling right now. I definitely do not have my phone on me. Do you? No. Great. All right, it's somewhere right here. Yeah, found it. So long it takes him to find it. I hear them faintly. They're really far away. Buddy is gone. I'm just gonna go follow the noise. Now it's turned into a rescue mission. I don't even know where I'm at right now. Yo! Oh my gosh. I don't know where I'm going. There's no trails this way, I don't believe. Oh, oh shit. I about went down the freaking mountain there, bud. I think the creek should be down here. We're going downhill enough. Watch Julius go uphill to try to get to us as we're coming down the hill. 
Sounds like he's going away from us. Yeah, see his tire track from where he came through. There he is! Come on, ladies. <laughs> he's going from us! Where is he going? Yo! Hey! Come on! Oh, that's deep. Woo! This idiot, bro. Hey! What's your problem, dude? Where'd you go? Where'd you go? I went to where we were going. Now, if I remember right, when me and Julius came over here, this is my neighbor's property, we came down this trail, and I guess that's why Julius brung us out this way, and it's somewhere... Oh my gosh. Damn, I didn't realize it was that big. Holy shit. Bud, that's a big one. We lost Julius when we found him, and now we found the freaking house. Let's see, where's the front of this thing? Look at the buzzard. There's two, there's another. Buzzards are living in there. What if there's a dead body in here? There's buzzards in here. They're about to attack you. They might throw up on me. That's kind of their way of attacking. They're not even that scared. That's the scary part. Oh, shit. The floor is falling through. Yeah, be careful. There's definitely a coyote den under this thing. Or a snake habitat. Dude, they're still there. There he is. Look at him. Oh, there he goes. No, he's sitting right there. Oh, yeah, that's how we die. We die in here. Welcome to Peter's house. <laughs> I can see Peter living in this thing, having his little fire in his fireplace. Making friends with the vultures. <laughs> so, look, look, so living room, bedroom. I don't really know where the kitchen is. This must be the kitchen. This is bedroom or kitchen right here. This is living room. What is this? That's probably your bedrooms. Well, that one fell in. That one's no more. It's rotted apart. This is nuts. Do an overnight challenge and catch and eat a buzzard? I'm not eating a buzzard. I'd rather eat the buzzard than stay in this thing maybe this is i don't well that's living room because there's a fireplace i don't know how it all works you could shoot a deer out of this thing use it as a deer blind oh shit let's check out the outside looks like the chimney fell apart dude no way that's old old oh yeah it's old it's got like real rock foundation no way that's what the duncan house was it's probably 1960 something yeah that joker is old son where's the driveway so i'll show you the driveway the driveway goes out that way and we actually use it to get to the creek we'll have to go show you that creek see if the, how high the water's up dude they're still here they're just waiting for us to die, dude. So they can eat us. Was that? Uh, yeah, definitely not a two-story. That must be the attic. I would not trust it. No, it's good. It's stable. It's up to code. Up to code. See what the back porch looks like. They had a pretty nice back porch, though. Overhang and all. Till it fell in. Yeah, it's up to code. Yeah. Something like that. When this was built, it probably was a pretty decent house. Oh, I bet it was. In today's market, this is like a $400,000 house. <laughs> <laughs> That's a fact, Jack. Yeah, if you were playing hide and seek, that'd be a good hiding spot. Hey, let's go to the creek and see what the water's doing. So, this was their front yard, it looks like. And then down here is going to be the driveway somewhere. Dude, look how thick these cedar trees grew up in here. Dude, this hella thick. Uh-oh, I did not come to the right spot to get to the driveway. Eh, we'll be fine. Yep. That ain't too bad. But this was the driveway coming up to this place. And then like up there, I guess, is, I mean, if they had an extremely big front yard, but it's probably still trees. That shit's crazy though, man. Abandoned house. But this is my neighbor's property and we can actually use it to get to the road out here and be able to go out to the creek. Let's go to the creek. Shoo. Oh, Jay's just popping them up, dude. Shoo. Oh, it's been so long since I've rode wheelies. It's always foreign to me trying to ride wheelies on a two-stroke. Oh, Julius is just riding it, bro. Hell yeah. Oh, here he comes. Yes, sir. Hopefully he's covering that rib right good. But it's a short little ride to the creek. And we like to come down here and shoot fish off the bridge with the bows. But we've had like a week of rain, so I'm sure the water's sky high. Cut the bike, save on some fuel. Come on, water. Please be down. I want to shoot fish. Ooh. Big oofs. God, it's chocolate milk. It is milky, my guy. Look how high the water got up, though. This is where me and Bree have been coming and shooting fish a lot. Oh, really? Yeah, we've had a freaking ball, man. Dude, it's damn near a little river. Dude, the property's so close to it, too. I want to find access to this so bad. Whether it's buying a property or just leasing property or something. Just so we can come down here in the summer and kayak and do whatever. Play in the water. Play in the water. That's right. Normally, this is crystal clear. Like, the water's down. It's like three and a half foot deep. Crystal clear water. It's just been raining this last week yeah dude just way too much rain normally it looks like you can drink that water like that's how good it normally is at least the concrete barriers are so high we won't go over i mean i guess you still could on a bike yeah that water's still boiling down through there gonna need another week for it to clear up somebody's gotta be come on there it is there's the wheelie Dude, Julius can just hop right back on a bike and be just as good as when he left do a little road ride let's go down this way See, there's another big bridge right here. There's just too much traffic on it to shoot fish from it. Woo! Oh my gosh. This thing hauls ass. 
Just just back there in a wheelie. This guy. Look at the creek. Yeah, somebody's got a little fishing area set up down there. That's sick. Oh, here comes Julius. Oh, he's getting back with it. Check it out on this side. Yep, dirty, dirty water. All right, we gotta get off this main road. I don't know where this other turn is, but I'm gonna find it. These bikes really don't have a high top end speed. Yeah, baby! They go left onto this road. Honestly, it's kind of nice, but none of these roads have road signs. See if I can even do a wheelie. Oh, or we can just watch do this. Yes, sir. See, I just, I can't do it anymore, bro. I feel so weird. I ain't got it no more. It's gonna take me a lot of practice to get it back. It's hard. Oh man, I ain't got it no more, bro. Dude, used to, I could wheelie a damn dirt bike. But I don't know, once I switched to two-stroke, man, that kind of, the whole riding wheelies thing's kind of faded for me. Can't do it like I used to. Yo, it is gorgeous out here. It's like a whole other planet out here. This would be really nice for hunting goats. Boy, I bet coyotes are loaded in these fields right now. If they just cut that hay, I'd put money on it. See, I really, I want to try to get permission in as many places I can to ride. That way we can just like go and explore, dude. It'd be so much fun. Woo! Come on! Oh, this ain't got it, bro. Not a chance. We gotta find some new hill climbs. That's what today's goal is gonna be. Finding hill climbs. Where are we gonna find hill climbs at? I don't know. Should be some pretty meaty hills this way. Huh, let's send it. Over the creek we go. Oh, man. Dude, these hills are pretty rowdy. If that log wasn't in the way, I could probably shoot the gap. There's just no trails going up it. So I don't think we have permission to hit these hills. We need to try to get permission. This hillside goes all the way down this creek, and it's about twice as steep as mine. Yeah, we gotta figure out who I gotta talk to to be able to go up that thing. Those are sweet. Pretty sure it's like that all the way down. Like, we got big hills out here, but none that are just like super steep. Oh, I know where we can go. We can go to the gorge. The gorge would probably be pretty fun. Oh, shit. I may have missed my turn, but I guess we can follow this and see where it takes us. I don't think I've ever been down this trail. Eh, somebody's got a climber stand right there. So we gonna turn it back around. Yeah, okay, so that's where we came in at. We're supposed to take this right. We're gonna go hit the gorge. Derek was just riding inside my bike. All right, gorge time. Oh, let's just go down here and hop in. That way we got a hill climb to go up. Yep, there's a hole. I couldn't see. I lost my vision very fast. Yeah, that ain't happening there, bud. That's why I don't go up these things, man. I couldn't see coming up. How the hell am I supposed to see going down? Yep, that's why I didn't do it. There's no traction. Gonna have to get off the bike. Either the bike's rolling down the hill or Braden is one or the other. What about both? That could happen. Move, trees, move. Yep. Oh, my face. All right. Come on, bud. Gorge time. Dude, where is he going? Chris is gonna love this one. Yeah, dude, we can make a pretty sick trail coming up and through here. Oh, yeah. Dude, you can just bank it off each side, bro. That would be fun. That was actually really fun. Dude, if we could bank from side to side. That's what I was doing. Follow me. Woo! Yeah, we've cleared out where we can really bank them. Ow. There we go. Through the brush. Yeah, if we could clear it to where we could go way up on each side, that'd probably be the funnest. That was fun. Ready? Yeah. Ow! That tree jumped me, bro. A tree grabbed my helmet and about to pulled me off. Doing something for no apparent reason. Great dad! Nope. Hey! Purposely not answering. Hey! What's the whole point of that? I ought to go look up here. Top of this big hill. So this is a pretty big hill right here. If we could just come up from that bottom, probably be pretty dope. Yeah, dude, that's probably the steepest hill on property right there. Oh, man. The gorge is steep. Ow! Trees. Face. Hurt. Follow me! Little jump. Yeah, we just gotta really clear up some trails so we can go fast for one and clear up some hill climbs. This place would be pretty freaking set for dirt bikes. This is so steep and it's a main trail. It's ridiculous. Why is this corn all laid over? Well, something killed the corn. Wasn't me. Woohoo! Woohoo! 
this Julius again. I'm telling you, this is gonna be one nasty mud hole. Oh, that mud's gonna be so nasty. Woo! Third gear. That's some nasty shit. Yeah? <laughs> we about collided there, bud. I can't believe we've had a week of rain. That's the wettest spot on the property. And it's not like muddy, muddy. <laughs> We're all just waiting for somebody to do something stupid. Oh, back through the mud. Oh, he got him! <laughs> He almost had it. My shit don't throw roofs like those do. That's too funny. Yeah, we're gonna have to turn that into a freaking sick mud hole. We need to freaking hurry up and build the Outlander. I'm waiting. I got a special surprise coming, so I can't build it just yet. But uh, once the special surprise gets here, we're gonna build that thing and turn it into a mud bike. That was so cute. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. <laughs> well, I'm gonna go ahead and throw this thing back up on the truck. Man, oh, man. There's just not quite enough to do on dirt bikes down here. Like, we need to freaking clear some trails, make it more high speed, maybe make some single track, get some stuff going for hill climbs and stuff. Then this place would be a hell of a lot of fun. Just a matter of doing everything, getting everything set up. But uh, that abandoned house is pretty cool. If you guys enjoyed today's video, if you would, smash the thumbs up button, hit the like, and subscribe. And we'll catch you guys on the next one. Catch you later.